Hello, my name is Mooncat and welcome back to a brand new video and brand new series where I will finally attempt to do the Viking settlement within the gold timer. I am currently on my diamond world where I have been slowly, slowly doing all of these settlements. I'm now on the final settlement so I am ready to complete this settlement. Now, I will attempt to do it in the gold timer, I have no idea how easy that will be. All of these previous settlements here, I have not cared about the timer at all. So it's probably over, over a year, year and a half, I don't know when did Vikings come out? It's been a long time since I completed the settlement in the gold timer. Back when I did it, the final quest was a little bit different as well, as I remember, so... We will see how this goes. I think I'll be able to do it, but <laughs> we'll, we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> so without further ado, let's start, let's jump into day one, and let's hope that we finish it well within the gold timer. So here we go. So first of all, let's have a look at the layout of the settlement. So we have one impediment here, that's a shame. Uh, we have quite a nice open area down here. So I think I'll probably use my expansions over here, but let's see how many, let's see, how can we do this layout? So I think we can, we can place the axsmith over here probably with a the road there, and then we can do, yeah, okay, I think what I'll do is I'll do something along the lines of this, and I think I can do one here as well. So I think we're going to do houses like this. Not sure how efficient this is, if this is the most efficient, but uh, I think, I do believe I remember that seven houses is the most you can have in the beginning. Perhaps I'm wrong, but... Let's see, four runestones. Let's place the runestones like this, we can do it like that. There we go. So, now we can place the runestones over here. I need four of these. There we go. Then we have the Xmith over here. Nice. Okay, so now we have. Hmm, I should have looked up these quests, but I do believe the first ones are quite simple. Let's just place a few more of these just to be ready. Let's see how long. 12 seconds. There we go. All right, that's Axsmith. Okay, so now we have Diplomacy, or Gather 20 Axes. So, now we have one hour for this. Uh, and then, I think the first uh, thing I need is to unlock a few expansions and the first technology. I'll try to do both uh, quite quickly. Hopefully I'm lucky and get a uh, for X boost, that would give me enough resources to get this and two expansions, I believe. So that's <laughs> really hope for that. But if not, should be able to get this quite quickly uh, in the course of the day. So what I'll do is that I will leave it here for now. I will uh, get right back into it in around uh, five hours when I collect this and we'll take it from there. Hello, it's one hour later and I just realized I probably should have done this from the start But I'm actually able to fit in one more axsmith, uh, so I think that's what I'll do uh, But then I will hopefully be able to get some more expansions and some more uh, And the shrines quicker and so on, so I think that's what I'll do. <laughs> I'll get one more It'll be a little bit offset, but uh, it's better late than later than ever so let's see here, just let's see what goods we need. Okay, so we need around 200 each of these, around 400 or 360 horns, and then 130 wool. So a relatively even, even distribution. I think that's quite nice. Um, hopefully I'll be able to get the, yeah, be able to get Beast Hunter relatively quickly. And then, and then yeah, the market. The clan house and so on. So yeah, <laughs> I'll leave it there and then I'll be back in four hours for this and five hours for this. 
All right, it's uh, five hours later, a little bit over. So let's collect that. Hopefully we get a boost. Nope, no boost. So I think what I'll do is that I will put this on again. And then I think, I think what I'll do, uh, let's see, should I get one expansion? <laughs> Not sure, should I get an expansion or should I wait for this? That's the question. So, I could, you know what, I think what I'll do is that I'll get one expansion like that. Uh, now at the moment, can't do too much with it, but I will do, let's see, how can I do this most efficiently? I don't know. Yeah, this is, it isn't too great, but what I'll do, yeah, what I'll do is I'll do that, and then in one hour, I will unlock the shrine. Uh, I will buy the one missing X if I need to. That's uh, something I'm definitely willing to spend for each settlement, so I'm gonna play this how I would, and for me, five diamonds, I would consider that more than, uh, yeah, not, <laughs> not too much to spend, so, so yeah. That's what I'll do. Um, so yeah, I leave it there, and then hope, hopefully I get a boost here. Then I will, ooh, then I'll get one much more expansion. Uh, I will open this, and then I will get myself a couple of shrines. I'll probably remove one of these. So I'll be back in one hour. All right, it's one hour later. So let's hope for some good results. No, no boost. All right. Um, let's see. I think I'll put that on still because I do still have some uh, copper coins to use. And then uh, what I'll do is that I will get the shrines. So first of all, I need some more uh, diplomacy. So let's quickly build some of these. Let's see. That is seven additional ones. So seven times six. That is forty. Two. I need one more. Uh, let's just get rid of that. There we go. I believe that should be enough, if I count it correctly. And then I'll get the one additional of these in a few, uh, in three hours. Um, so yeah, I think this will be good. Uh, I believe I'll be able to fit in two. Uh, two shrines at the moment. Um, I think what I'll do, yeah, I'll keep both of these for now, and then in three hours I'll probably replace this, uh, or perhaps I can, perhaps I can still use it if I get one more expansion and a few more shrines. But I might replace this if I don't have enough coins. I don't think I will have enough coins by this night, so to run both of these overnight, that is eight, uh, four thousand coins and I'm not sure if I'll be able to get that many. Uh, let's see, yeah, one more. And there we go. So let's spend those five diamonds. I don't mind. Let's pick up the reward there. So two shrines. Uh, I think I'll be able to fit two shrines. I do believe I need to disconnect a few of these huts, but that's fine. Uh, so let's see here. I can fit one shrine here at least. Uh, then I need one more. Yeah, that should be fine. So I'll do that. I'll get one more shack over there. I will move these around a little bit. Let's see. For these, I get. I get 93 per four hours. How much do I get from these? I get 100 in one hour. So that is 400 for, yeah. I think it's better to do it this way. I could connect three of these or one shrine. So for three of these, I would get, I'm gonna get 300 in four hours. I would get 400 from a shrine. So this is more efficient. Although, perhaps I should try uh, try to get some more roads to these as well. Perhaps I would be able to do that somehow. Perhaps if I moved this down here somewhere, perhaps. 
Um, no, I don't think so. I think this is the best I can do for now. Um, yeah, I think that's good enough. And there we go, I'll put those on one hour productions, I will keep collecting these, then in three three hours I'll be back and collect this one. Alright, here we go, let's collect and let's hope for a boost. <laughs> nope, still no boost, but that means we are able to get this expansion. And what I'll do is I will get two more shacks, I will place those down here, and then I'll get two more shrines up there. So. I have time for another four hours on that, uh, then let's see, I'll be producing da, 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 500 per hour, uh, across four hours, that, that's 2,000, I think I'll keep, hmm, yeah, I'll keep both of these, um, I'll put that on eight hour productions in one hour. And then I'll put that on later production as well later on. I think I'll have enough of that. Uh, 2000. Mm. It'll be close, but I think I'll be able to run perhaps a, a couple of five minute or one hour or 15 minute productions on these. And that one, yeah, I'll be able to get a little bit there. So I think I'll have enough. I think I'll be able to produce 2.6 thousand of course for the next four or so hours to get both of these on eight hour productions overnight. Right, let's move these over here. Let's get to shrines. There we go. Ah, sorry. Uh, not quite sure where I got the five number. I have four of these. Okay, so that is... Okay, what I'll do, what I'll do is that in one hour I will collect this. I will place down one or two more shrines. And then in three hours I will replace this. And then I'll have run both of these overnight on 8-hour productions. That's what I'll do. And then, let's see, I think I'll get my... These will probably be my next two expansions, I believe. Or possibly these three down here. I don't think this impediment will be too difficult to play around. So. Probably th these two. Let's see long left five seconds then I'll put all of these on one hour productions and I'll be back in a little bit over one hour to uh, or a little, little bit under one hour to collect that one so one hour one hour one hour and one hour all right I'll be back in one hour all right it's one hour later let's collect any boost now there we go finally a boost now do I have enough I do not have enough for that yet so okay that's fine uh, <clears throat> and yeah, I don't want to buy any more of those, so I will delete that. Let's see, can I get two of these? Um, I can't... I don't think I'm... I can't remove any more of these shacks, but is there a way that I am able to fit in? Um, Possibly... Mm. No, I don't think so. Okay, I want to try one quick thing. Perhaps that might work. Uh, although, no, that won't work. No, I think I'll leave it there. Uh, I will do this. Get one extra road there. Actually, one more extra road. There we go. Let's see. That has four hours. I believe some of these have... A shorter time. Let's see. Three hours. The other might be only two hours left. Let's see. Three. Four. And uh, no, those would have four as well. Okay. Okay. There we go. So now that has three hours. There we go. I'll put that on five minutes to sync up with these. And then I'll put those on one hour again. And I'll run those for another. Uh, three hours or two hours and then I will replace this again with another uh, Axsmith and run them all on eight hours overnight. Alright, let's see if we get lucky with the final collection of the day. Any boosts? No, no boosts. So let's see here. We need another 
9, so I'll uh, unlock that tomorrow. So what I'll do now is that I will put this on 8 hour and then I'm gonna run these for a couple of 5 minutes of productions until I've collected another 400, 350 coins. Uh, probably another half an hour um, I'm assuming. I'll put that on 8 hour as well. I'll put these on 8 hour, then I'll go, I'll go to bed and then I'll, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. So, thank you very much for watching this first day. Uh, hopefully I'm able to complete it well within the gold time, but I'm not sure this is the first proper Viking settlement I've played in probably a year, so it will be interesting to see. So, anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.